Welcome back to my channel, Madden Language, and we're going to tackle dividing fractions. How to divide fractions. So let's start with the first topic, dividing a fraction to another fraction. So if we have an example like this one, 1 half, divide mo ng 1 fourth, ano yung mga steps natin gagawin para ma-divide tayo ng fraction? So pag dividing a fraction to another fraction, we have four steps. The first one is, get the reciprocal of the divisor and change the sign to multiplication. Pangalawa, multiply mo na yung first numerator to the second numerator. Pangatlo, multiply the first denominator to the second denominator. And lastly, reduce mo yung fraction to lowest term if possible. So going back to the problem, 1 half divide mo ng 1 fourth. Babalik tarin mo lang yung 1 fourth, so that will be 4 over 1. At, it's change mo yung sign from division to multiplication. So that will be 1 half times 4 over 1. So we multiply na natin yung numerator. Yung dalawang numerator, multiply na natin. That will be 1 times 4. That will be 4. And two, yung denominator naman, that will be 2 times 1 is equal to 2. So the final answer will be 4 halves. And you can still reduce it to 2. Kasi 4 divided by 2 is 2. Alright, so another example. 2 thirds, divide mo ng 5 fourth. So again, you have to take the reciprocal of 5 fourth. So that will be 4 fifth. Kunin mo yung reciprocal ng divisor. So, need to change mo din yung sign from division to multiplication. So, let's start multiplying the numerators. That will be 2 times 4, that is 8. Next one, yung denominator naman, that will be 3 times mo ng 5. That will be 15. And the final answer will be 8 over 15. And that's already the lowest term. So you need final answer na yan. Alright, so next topic tayo. Dividing a whole number to another fraction. Let's say we have 2 divide mo ng 1 fourth. So we have 5 steps in doing this one. Pag may mag divide ka ng whole number to another fraction, first step natin is place a 1 below the whole number. The 1 will be the denominator, and the whole number will be the numerator. Pangalawa, get the reciprocal of the divisor and change the sign to multiplication. Same steps then. Pangatlo, we have to multiply the first numerator to the second numerator. And fourth one, multiply the first denominator to the second denominator. And lastly, we have to reduce a fraction to lowest term if possible. So going back to the problem, 2 divided by 1 fourth. So again, take the reciprocal of 1 fourth. That will be 4 over 1 and change the sign to multiplication. Now, we have to multiply the numerators. That will be 2 times 4 is equal to 8. And denominators naman, that will be 1 times 1. That is 1. And the answer is 8 over 1. Or, that is simply 8. Alright, so third topic tayo. How about dividing a mixed number to another fraction? Let's say we have a problem like this. 3 and 3 fourth, divide mo siya sa 2 fifth. So we also have steps, 5 steps in dividing a mixed number to another fraction. The first one is convert the mixed number to improper fraction. Second, get the reciprocal of the divisor and change the sign to multiplication. Pangatlo, Multiply the first numerator to the second denominator. Multiply the first numerator to the second numerator. Pangapat is multiply the first denominator to the second denominator. And lastly, you have to reduce a fraction to lowest term if possible. So para sa naman yung steps, nakaiba lang, you have to convert the mixed number to improper fraction. Going back to the problem, 3 and 3 4 divide mo ng 2 5th, gawin mo muna ng improper fraction yung 3 and 3 4th. So that will be 4 times 3, 12 plus 1 and 3, that will be 15. 15 over 4. 15 over 4, divide natin ng 2 fifth. Next step, you have to take the reciprocal of the divisor, which is 2 fifth magiging 5 halves. Tapos, papalitan natin yung division sign to multiplication. And we can multiply it na. So, let's start with the numerator. We have 15 times 1 ng 5, that will be 75. And for the denominator, that will be 4 times 2, which is 8. And that's already the answer. 
However, kung pwede nyo gawin siyang mixed number, you just have to divide the numerator to the denominator. So that will be 75 divided by 8. That will be 9. And there will be a remainder of 3. So the final answer will be 9 and 3, 8. Alright, so let's go to the last topic. We have steps in dividing a mixed number to another mixed number. So we have 5 steps. First one, we have to convert both mixed numbers to improper fractions. Second, get the reciprocal of the divisor and change the sign to multiplication. Third one is multiply the first numerator to the second numerator. And fourth step, multiply the first denominator to the second denominator. And lastly, if you can reduce a fraction to lowest term, please do it. So same steps lang. Ang iba lang dito is you have to convert the mixed numbers to improper fractions. Pag dalawa silang mixed number, kailangan mo talaga siyang i-convert both sa improper fractions. So for example, we have 2 and 1 6. Di-divide mo siya sa 3 and 1 third. So again, you have to convert both of them to improper fractions. So for that one, 6 times 2, that will be 12. Plus mo ng 1, that will be 13. And yung sa 3 and 1 thirds naman, that will be 3 times 3, that's 9. Plus mo ng 1, that will be 10 over 3. And once we have converted both the fractions, the mixed number, to improper fraction, we can now solve it. So again, you have to take the reciprocal of 10 thirds. So that will be 3 over 10. And you have to change the sign from division to multiplication. So yung 13 uh, times mo ng 3, that will be 39. And 6 over 6 and 10, that will be 60. So the answer is 39 over 60. But again, if you can reduce it to lowest term, please do it. So yung sagot mo na 39 over 60, pwede pa siyang ma-reduce. That will be 13 over 20. And that's the end of the lesson of how to divide fractions. Next video natin will be about adding fractions to man. Like 2 thirds plus 1 fourth or 1 and 3 fifth plus 2 thirds. And if you would like to comment or suggest another math and language video or kung may assignment kayo, please comment down below. Again, this is James, your math and language instructor. Please like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.